What's going on everybody? Brian here from Brian's Broadcast. I hope all of you are doing fantastic. Guys, have you ever come across a situation where Dua Fragrances inspired you to buy the OG? Well, this is probably my second or third time something like that happened. And the fragrance that inspired me to get Nishane's Wulong Cha, the review for this one, the fragrance that inspired me was none other than Mandarin Oolong Tea 1. Now this is a combination of eccentric molecules, Molecule 01 Mandarin and Nishane's Oolong Cha. And I decided right away after smelling this one that if Oolong Cha for real, if it smells even 10% close to this thing, I mean, it should be the other way around, but because I never smelled the OG before, if this one smells anything close to that one, I would definitely get a full bottle of Wulong Cha. And finally, I did. And I'm super happy that I did. Again, Dua is notorious for making fragrances, clones and all the stuff. And then again, they sometimes nail it or sometimes it's a total miss because they have that, you know, they like the ingredients they use. Maybe it's not of totally high quality and stuff like that. So, you know, sometimes fragrances smell sour or has that bad vibe. Mandarin Wulong Tea 1.0 is one of those fragrances where they totally nailed it like it's really nice and smooth. No harsh or sharp edges or diaper smell or sour smell. Let's get that out of the way. Let's talk about Wulong Cha from Nishane. So as per the website, Nishane's website, on the top you get bergamot, orange, listia, Listy, Listia, whatever it is, and you get mandarin oranges. So there's a lot of citrus going on in the opening. And then in the heart, you get wulong tea and nutmeg. And at the base, you get musk and fig. Guys, if you want to experience heaven when you spray a fragrance, wulong cha is probably one of them. It's so uplifting. It's so bright, it's so soothing, it's so smooth, like you feel you're totally in heaven. Extremely uplifting. Now the term Wulong Tea, I was looking it up, I think if I did not get it wrong, it's a type of green tea that has a certain kind of maturity. Now there's a certain way of uh, preparing this Wulong Tea. Now the there's a certain type that if it's not aged too much, it, you get a certain kind of smell. And then if it's aged for quite a while, if you prepare the tea, it gives you that fruity, herbaceous feel. This is exactly what you're getting here. It's a very beautiful citrus opening and the combination of all that citrus, it's phenomenal. You will never find anything that smells as good as this one. Of course, there are better ones, maybe, maybe up there, maybe down there, but this is something very, very unique. I don't think there's a fragrance in the market, probably. I mean, I have never experienced anything like this before, but this is very, very nice and beautifully done. Now, the fragrance in the opening, like I said, it's very bright, citrusy, smooth, no sharp edges, very nice. Has this sweetness to it, has this beautiful smoothness, and the fragrance very slowly starts drying down around like two to three hours mark. That's when you start hitting the mids. In the mids, you get this combination of the citrus. So the citrus doesn't die away right away. I mean, um, usually citrus or freshies have this habit of where the citrus part is gone. By the first one or two hours, the citrus is absolutely gone. You're left with something else. But with Nishane's Wulong Cha, it's not the case. The citrus lives on. It comes and combines with this beautiful oolong tea that has this beautiful fruity herbaceous kind of feel. The herbaceous feel is not too much. And there's this presence of nutmeg. Now the nutmeg is not a very spicy one. It's, I, I believe, like I have a feeling it's acting like a supporting note where you get that tiny tad bit of sweet spiciness from it. But that's about it. It's a beautiful, I mean, heavenly feel that you get. Further drying down this fragrance, the musk and the fig. Now, the musk is kind of, again, gives you kind of like that fruity vibe. 
again, the fruitiness just lives on, but it's not like one of the super fruity, uh, like a strawberry or, you know, something else. But the fruitiness I'm talking about is the citrusy fruitiness, right? It just lives on. The fig here, it's phenomenal. Why do I say that? Because fig, again, it's a green kind of note. It has this beautiful vibe. And the best part is the more this fragrance starts drying down, the further it dries down, the fig just feels so creamy. It's very creamy and almost kind of has this milky, creamy vibe, which is just hands down very nicely done. So this fragrance, again, gives you a total mood booster on a gloomy day. Imagine wearing this on a gloomy Monday where you're having this Monday blues like, oh man, I'm gonna go to work. There's so much to be done. Maybe I have to deal with my boss. Put this on and then all your tension, all your, st all your stress goes away. This is the beautiful kind of fragrance that Wulong Cha is. Longevity wise, if you're talking, although it's a freshie and because it's a Nishani's product, longevity is through the roof. I got more than 10 plus hours with this fragrance and I went with like six to seven sprays. It just lives on. On clothes, it live on forever. On skin, that six to seven sprays, definitely more than 10 plus hours phenomenal stuff the creaminess the beautiful fruitiness the musky beautiful like dry down is just phenomenal anybody who's looking into this fragrance just rest assured like sometimes people may say it's too feminine it's not at all too feminine this is very much unisex anybody can pull it off all kind of situation like casual date night um, office meeting, office setup, it's very pleasant, so definitely nobody will be complaining unless a person has a problem with fragrances in general. You know those office Karens, male or female, they'll be like, who's wearing cologne? No. Except for those people, anybody who's gonna get a whiff of this is totally gonna love it. So that was my take and experience with Wulong Cha, and this is a beautifully done fragrance. Let me know in the comment section if you have tried this fragrance. If you want to try it, let me know in the comment section. Share your experiences about this one. And until the next video, guys, please stay safe, take care, and all the best. Mm -hmm.